Hi everyone and welcome to Nico's Kitchen's Christmas Special. Today, something very special indeed. Something that the little kids can help you make. And I'm telling you now, they are going to love it. We're going to be making Christmas cookie houses. So guys, the first thing that we're going to do to get started on our Christmas cookie house is the icing that's going to be the glue that holds all our pieces together. So, into a bowl, I've just got some icing sugar here, or con some confectionery sugar, I'm just going to add it straight in. And to that, I'm just going to add a very small amount of water. And just give it a good stir until it's nice and thick. So that's what you're after there guys, just this really thick icing paste, just like that. Now for the next part, you're going to need a piping bag. Now you can buy these disposable ones in the stores, but if you can't find them, just grab those lunchbox bags, and if you curl them up just like a normal piping bag, snip the end off, you'll have exactly the same thing. So what you'll end up with guys is something like this. Just a small incision at the top, and you can see the icing will be piped through there. So now we're gonna actually start assembling our cookie house. And for the base, I'm gonna be using some lady sponge fingers. Now guys, using the scissors just along the edge, very carefully, I just want you to cut a flat surface. Just a flat surface like that. And just repeat that one more time so you've got two of these. So using your icing guys, just pipe a line straight down one side of the sponge fingers. Now, if you want to use a cake stand to present this on, go for it. I'm just going to be using a normal plate. So I've just got one normal sponge finger. I'm going to pop that in the middle. And I've got our two sides that we've piped with icing. And I'm just going to squeeze them together. So that's all you have to do for our base. Now we're going to get started on building the house. So I'm going to be using a couple of types of cookies for this guys. This one is a hundred and thousands and this is obviously a wafer, but you can use any cookies that you like for this. I'm just using these, but make sure you try and get them around the same size for the walls. So again, using our icing, what I want you to do is just pipe a line on one side, just like that, and then repeat the same process on just one side of the other wafer. And being very careful, I'm just gonna grab the other cookie. Now, I'm gonna be gluing it on this side, so the presentation is this side. Just very carefully place it down on the wafers, and then just very carefully pop it over onto its back, just like that. And just using the same method as we did before, just pipe a line on that side, and then a line on that side as well. And then again, just popping that top straight on there and just line them up as good as you can. Now again, being very, very, very careful guys, just lay it on its back. And then again, I want you to pipe on that side, just like that. And then again, on that side. So being very careful, I'm gonna pop the icing side down. So now we've done the base and we've built the walls, we're going to get started on the roof. And I've got another wafer here, and what I'm going to do with the scissors is just cut it in half very carefully. So that's what you end up with. Once you cut it in half, you've got two triangles. Now back over to our house, and just on our cookie there, not the wafer, I'm going to pipe some icing straight over the top and I'm also going to do the back as well. And then with our triangles that we've just cut, I'm going to place one on the top and make sure you get it right in the middle. And the other one goes at the front of the house. Along the triangles that we've just put on, I want you to put some icing straight down there like that. And then again on the other sides and very carefully Two at the one time, I'm just going to place our roof panels straight on top. Just hold them there for a second and they'll set. So guys, you can just see there how our cookie house is coming together. 
Now to build our front door is really easy. Just take a wafer, I've taken a chocolate wafer this time, and I'm gonna cut it in quarters. And just grab your icing again, just pop a little circle at the back. And then at the front of the house, we're just gonna pop it straight on the bottom so it looks like the front door. Now just some more decoration. I've got a licorice all sorts here. And again, using the scissors, I'm just gonna cut it in half, diagonal. Again, just put a little circle of icing just on the bottom. And then on one side of the roof panels, I'm just gonna place it on there. And that licorice all sorts is gonna act as our chimney. And last but not least, I've just got some sugar jellies, just like that, and again, I'm just gonna pipe a little bit of icing sugar, and then at the front of house, and these are gonna act as our trees, I'm just gonna place them on that end of the sponge finger. And that's all you really have to do, guys. It is super, super simple. The kids can do this, and it is a whole ton of fun. And if you wanted to do something just a little extra special, you can just shake some icing sugar over the top and it will act as some snow. And that's it guys, like I said, it is super, super simple, it looks fantastic, and it's something the kids can do over Christmas, and they will love it, I guarantee it. All the ingredients are below, as always, check it out, and give this a go, because it's a whole lot of fun. You guys have a great Christmas, and a safe new year, and I'll see you next time.